What kind of gentleman pays visits to people at this late hour? <laughs> we were just talking, dude. Calm down. All right, so then this, if I track it now, where does it take me? Just back to him? Bring back the Braille notes to Mason, 204. What can I do for you? Uh. Mason, why would you waste your skill and knowledge on crafting snake oil and fake drugs? But this is my only opportunity to continue practicing my art by giving false hope to desperate people. They all see me as disabled and useless. I'm sick of their pity. Um. To accept what has happened to us and what we have become is a difficult process. I'm sorry for what you've had to endure. You'll not get my respect through cheap compassion, Doctor. Speak to me like I'm a normal human being. That's all I ask. Goodbye. Hmm. Okay, so I... Tell me. You never finished this investigation? You yeah. I don't know where I find the things. They just seem to kind of happen, I guess. Uh, actually, erase marker. Okay, so there's that. That's done for now. We at least got talking to him. Oops. I guess now it's just main mission. Uh, getting back there. I kind of wish that they had a fast travel at each like of the main town areas. That would be nice. So I could like, fast travel back to the hospital. See you later. All right. We'll just hold on the, we'll hold on to the Braille um, mission, but there's not much I can do about it at the moment. Gonna... Oh, that's how I do that ability. Hold on, we're just gonna get some blood from this guy. Excuse me, gotta go. And mate. Yeah, it is it is a little bit annoying to get around. I that's the that's supposed to like my one thing about the game I would change if I had a choice. Okay, um let me just pop up here real quick. I'm gonna make another cure for migraine. Perfect. Just so I have it for later, or if I come across somebody. All right, so side quest stuff, we're good. We're kind of just on main story now. Yeah, there was something in here. Well, this whole area was locked when they were talking before. It's weird. Oh, I bet these guys up here are alive now. Because I... Or I had rested or whatever. Yeah, they're back. Oh wait, did I, oh, did I fight that guy? I didn't fight these guys. Occasionally, you make a good point. We're being misled, or worse, we're being baited by leeches. Trying it. Oh, that's pretty cool. Has a huge cooldown though. That's pretty sweet though. I'm a fan of that. Uh, let me pick... Sure. Oh. 
Ah, oh, God. No, no, stop. You're killing my blood. There's a hideout right there. All right, anything else here that I need to look at real quick? Oh, yep. Oh, that sucks. The marks on this woman's neck were made by the fangs of a vampire. Hmm. This is the very flower my mother tossed on Mary's coffin. Someone is targeting my family. Yeah, I think they're trying to get your attention, it seems like you're asking me. Her shoes and clothes are quite worn out. Okay. And search the pockets. Only a golden watch in her pocket. Oh, we're taking the watch. Why would you leave it? I see you. Right then. It's a sick game. But given no choice in the matter, I might as well win it. <laughs> okay. Um, did that... Anything on the watch? No. Hey, safe house. Let's go. Not that there's really anything in here I need, but you know. It's locked. Why? I don't use any of the guns. Yeah, hey, uh, vertical. Did you use the guns very often? I I just don't use the gun. I don't I don't like them in this game. Not once. Okay. I, I I mean, I used it when they first introduced it, uh, like, to try it out. And then I was like, nah. And then I tried, like, I got a better, like, a shotgun. And I was like, oh, you know what? I might as well try this. Maybe it was just the one gun I didn't like. Nah, didn't care for the guns in general. Okay, it's not just me, then. They do kind of seem like, I don't know. Use the scalpel early game, then switch to stakes. I use, I use the... Liston knife for my offhand. That's what I get the blood back with. And now I use the uh, good hacksaw. Yeah. I thought about using the scythe for a while, but eh. I'm not a fan of the two-handed weapons either. Jonathan. What was that? Hello? God? That's cool. I won't let you escape. I want to do that. I also want to loot everything, though. That's my other problem. No, she got on the roof. I went on the roof. Fine. You're very fast, but I'll catch you. <laughs> yeah, as I say, as I'm like slowly walking, lo looking for loot. Hacksaw on stake for you. I like the hacksaw a lot. Where am I, by the way? Oh. Okay. Oh, 
There's guards there. The Exile is great with blood absorption. Yeah, I have, I have, um, I think I did one damage, one blood absorption. Oh, back in the cemetery. I was just here. They've all been butchered. Ooh, sucks for them. Sounds like a them problem. Aw, bullets. It's like the one thing I don't want. I can still sense a presence. Someone's got presents? Oh, rat. Rat, rat, rat. Come here. This is despicable. I feel like at this point you gotta be over it, man. Good thing I sent the one lady out of here. No? You can mess up the no kill run here? Oh boy. Uh, I told you to go home! And the way they do this, they have this game set up, you can't just like save and then go back, you know? Like you have to, like once you commit to a choice, you're committed to it. They don't play the, oh, you can go and load the save again. Nah, they don't play that game here. Joseph Larrabee. That was the guy... He was the priest, wasn't he? Help me, please. <laughs> you. What have you done? What I do? Michael Larrabee. What happened? Demon. Hell Scourge. Son of perdition. Vicar. Vicar. Jonathan's no demon. He's just a soul returned oh. from the dead, like your Christ vicar. Mary, Is it sister? Really oh, it's me, all right, precious brother. What is Mother doing here? I'm gathering the family for a final reunion, all smiling, all dead, thanks to the good Doctor Reed. Mary, mother. Say hello to your son. Hello, Jonathan. Mother, uh oh, I... this is what definitely not going to end well for the mom. Mother. The prodigal son has lost his tongue. Oh. Our Jonathan always had the first and last word at dinner. The entertainer, the star of our show. I'm sorry. Let me explain. Shut up. It's my turn to do the talking. I have this nasty hole in my chest, Johnny. It needs to breathe. Of course. You can speak now. Uh-oh. Is she the villain? My prayers went so long without an answer. My husband killed in France. My child carried away by the flu. My brother promising to return in his letters, then disappearing in thin air. I went from hospital to hospital. Cemetery to cemetery, grave to grave. I've lifted every stone in London, searching for an end to the nightmare. And there you were, in front of me, on a dark pier. The hunger had taken me. The joy to have finally found you. I longed for your arms, a final happy ending to so much tragedy, to tell me all would be well again, as you did when we were children. Uh-oh. It was this filthy dock where you greeted your sister. I dug a tunnel from my grave with my fingers and teeth. Mary. I thought I had murdered you. I tried to end myself. We've been through the same horror. 
We are a disease, Jonathan. A sickness. The yeah, the mother's definitely uh, all um, we kiss. a thrall at the moment. Look at me. Admire your ilk. I'm so sorry. Apologies will not suffice. I demand reparation. I want a miracle. Are you a miracle worker, Dr. Reed? No? <laughs> I'll show you mine then. The family Reed. Reunited and complete. Living forever in a red sea of eternal love. Time to go, mother. Say hello to my son. Mary, wait. <gasps> Oh. I have made friends oh. with vital knowledge, vampires. We are not alone, Mary. With time, we can learn to live almost as we lived before. How long? What? How long will this masquerade continue? I've been watching you. All these knights in Whitechapel pretending you're still a doctor. You believe you're just fighting a disease. But it's you, the disease, Jonathan, you! I'm a scientist. I'll find a solution. Let our mother go, please. You were always the one to sway me to reason, Jonathan. But before, your motivations were always pure. Now you're tainted. Let her go! She has no part to play in this. <sighs> Very well. Have you heard our good doctor? You can go home, mother. Go home and rest in peace. Yes. I'll go home. And rest. Oh? <laughs> it's so easy to make them obey or forget puppets for our pleasure. I've seen you have your fun. You are mad. <laughs> So that's what I am, Doctor. Mad. Okay, oh, I thought the mom was going to die. I, I've been hearing these voices in my head. One in particular, that of my dead brother. This is the reason I must kill you. Not for your betrayal. Not for our poisonous kiss. Not even for the lies you tell yourself. No. It's so that smooth and wicked voice will stop ringing in my ear. <laughs> Are you gonna stab Man. me with a cross? No, don't. Time to die, brother. And this time for good. Uh oh. Hi, Mary. Wait, what's that? What is this? Jonathan, kill him. Revel in your true nature. I think I just messed up my no-kill run. I thought it was a mouse behind the, the thing. Oh, man. Oh. What the? Well, that was cool. I'm... And F. Yeah, uh... I did not... Uh, I'm like, I'm not very upset with myself right now. Excuse me. I'm trying to figure out my life at the moment. Hold on. You left me. I didn't realize that's what was going on there. Kiss me again. Uh, well, rip my perfect run. Oh, that was cool. I like her blood, that blood ability. That's pretty cool. Abomination. I'm just gonna heal myself a bit. One more, please. Thank you. I kind of figured I wasn't gonna get to do a perfect run anyway, so. I mean, I assume I'm going to try for the good ending, not the perfect ending. So. Ow. Ow. 
Ow! You killed me, brother. Come to me, Jonathan. I did burn away her mind. Kiss me again, Move. Oh. Well, the good I think you can't have any districts go hostile. Yeah, it's yeah, you can't have any of them go hostile, which now has created an an interesting uh interesting point. I could now have the freedom to maybe pick and choose some uh, people who might just disappear. You know. I gotta heal. Ow, ow. What the heck was that? And why did it hurt so bad? She has been watching. That's not good. All right. What have you done? Oh, I have no more blood. Ow. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Need to heal! Oh, God! Mary! Mary, hold on! Mary, we can, we can, talk, we can talk about this. We can talk about this, Mary. 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 Yeah, there's like a serial killer in one of the places I could probably go eliminate, you know? Ow. Gotta heal, gotta heal, gotta heal. Okay. We need to heal a decent amount. Okay, okay, okay. Stay away from me. I'm healing. Okay, we're good. Okay. Ow. Ow. Aren't you feeling sick, ma'am? Yes, there we go. my chance to ah! use that. Uh. 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 moment. I'm trying to not die at the- oh, I have no blood. Oh, no. Oh, God. We're in trouble. We're in trouble. We're in trouble. Just 
Do I have enough? I do. Oh god! Oh, she's so close. But I'm also very close to dead. Yes! Rich blood sample. Ooh. Well, brother. It's time to bring this conversation to an end. Forever. You know I will not play this game. Calm now, Doctor. You're like a rabid dog. Or think you're performing an autopsy. Don't be ridiculous. I'll kill them all. The kind Dr. Swansea. The sweet little lass with hair of red. I am the Harbinger, bringing your punishment. Mary. Don't you see? This is not me. Flesh that never ages. All nightmare. No dream. Bring it to a close. Let me sleep. Oh. I will find a cure, Mary. I swear it. Yes, at last. I can forgive you. Man, killed her twice. Aww. Oh. <laughs> I'm controlling the game again. Just kind of put her back in her grave, I guess. This is a very awkward walk. I accidentally killed the stupid guy. Uh, Hail Mary achievement. <laughs> uh, so mad that I killed that guy. I thought it was a mouse behind the thing, so I'm like, oh, okay. I didn't, I, didn't, I totally forgot he was there. Oh. As I shed one last red tear for my fallen sister, I realized the entire world now revolves around this singular word. The epidemic that has stricken London is not the Spanish flu. It is transmitted through the blood via violent biting, turning survivors into frenzied immortals. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed. I am a vampire, born anew into an age of death and pestilence. While plotting factions close in around me, I am sworn to find the source of this epidemic. I am convinced greater perils are still to come. I know the answers I seek are hiding in our blood. Chapter 4, Rising Fever. Dear Dr. Reed, I hope you let, uh, this letter fi will quickly find you. For I need to speak with you as soon as possible. The situation is evolving very quickly in the West End, and I'm convinced we are now in great danger. The God of Prewin has launched a great hunt in London, and for a few nights they have been actively searching and killing all Ekon they can locate. Uh, Lord Redgrave, chairman of the Escalon Club, recently contacted me. He wishes to meet you immediately. Please come to my mansion any night that suits you. We will discuss all of this. Uh, with this letter, you'll find an official pass allowed to go through any barricade or quarantine checkpoint throughout the city. <gasps> Yay! If that's what it, if that means what I think it means, that's awesome. I hope that's what that means. Boop. All right. 
Cool beans. Uh, I could rest to evolve. Probably not a terrible idea. Uh, yeah, I might do that. Okay. So, oh, what? You two got new things. When did that happen? You both have a cold. Okay, anyone else sick? Sanitized? Oh, fatigue, fatigue, fatigue. Oh, God. Three fatigue and two cold. When did that happen? And two cold. All right, I have enough, but let's just make one extra of each. Okay, so it's people that are here. Pippa and I think one of the guys that was down by the canal. All right, uh, so that being said, we're going to do some curing real quick, and then... Uh... Hmm, I think i got to figure out life. All right, Pippa. Good evening, nurse. Good evening, Doctor. Do you need... I'm afraid... Not under... Thank you. There you go. Goodbye. All right, she's cured. And Whitechapel took a big hit. The other part of me, like, I, I kind of want to see what happens when you kill the people. But also at the same time, it's like, I don't want to do it quite yet. Hello again. Good evening. Uh, I haven't talked to these guys, have I? Nope. How do you feel about Oswald Thatcher? You are more than friends, aren't you? I, I love him. I love Oswald. We knew we wouldn't survive the war without each other. But I am terrified, Doctor. What frightens you so much? Well, people find out. Oswald says I'm ashamed, but it ain't that. It's more, well, you know, never thought I'd love a man. Uh, Newton Blight uh, doesn't accept his homosexuality. Um enjoy your love and enjoy life as long as you can Mr. Blight. Don't let anyone tell you who you should love or how. Enjoy your life. I appreciate ah, attack him. Words, <laughs> but it ain't that easy. It's also new to me. Okay. Uh worried about London to do you need medic right side. Go out here do your work. There you go. Quick talk to you, because I know you'll have something. Uh, here we go. Tell me about your true feelings for Newton. I love him. I'm not ashamed to say it. He's the best thing that ever happened to me. I can't imagine life without him. Why you should you be ashamed? I admire your honesty. Why should you be ashamed? I'm not, I said. Newton sees it differently. I admire your honesty. It takes courage to stand up to society. The world needs people like you to create change. Courage is what we needed in the trenches, looking death in the face every day. I speak plain. I speak my mind. Have you always been this straightforward? All I know is, before you saved me by the sewer, my only regret was I wouldn't be able to hold or kiss Newton again. I love him, that's all. Okay, back. Newton is conflicted about his feelings towards you. Would you like to talk about it, Oswald? It makes me sad. <laughs> the way he, like, yells at him. Would like you like to talk about it, Oswald? Somehow tainted. It hurts to see him so lost. His love for you is genuine. I'm certain he wasn't lying to me when he expressed his feelings for you. Newton still has to accept it, knowing he'll be seen as a queer, a fairy. Less than a man in those simple-minded bigots' eyes. Though he's more of a man than they'll ever be, so fuck them all. Fair point. All right. Goodbye. Those guys are cured. God, I want to pick him off at the same... Like, like, I wouldn't have been him. I would choose 
Like, okay, if they all were worth the same, I would pick Mortimer would be my first one to pick. Or Clay. Because, I mean, we saw him kill someone. And then Mortimer, um, he wants to die. So, you know, conscious, not really big there. I'd feel really bad killing Harvey. He's got a family. She, I wouldn't feel too bad about. Like, crazy witch chick. The rest of them would be kind of terrible. Let's see. For the docs, I mean, both of these are pretty bad people. I mean, they're pretty much mafia. Uh, so, eh. is it this guy? I think he's the serial killer, so him dying would have been fine. The mom of the serial killer, I would have felt a little bad about. This guy, no one would miss him. That would be, that part we know, because he is all by himself. Uh... Is she... Oh. She's the one with Alzheimer's. Uh, I wouldn't really feel that necessarily bad about her. I mean, the way she's living is kind of a hell in itself. Uh, that guy I'd feel a little bit bad about. I honestly don't remember much about that dude. Uh, The drunk? I mean... Eh. He's also got a lot of deep things he's probably wanting to go. Um... <laughs> I, I don't want to kill Ichabod. I want him to live a long time and be his best friend. I want to be his best friend so that, you know, he's best friends with the vampire. He doesn't know. I uh, don't know much about that guy. Uh, and then these two or whatever. Uh, this area. Hey, that priest. I don't like that priest. The rest of them are kind of all right, though. Hmm. Yeah. Anyway, uh, her. I wouldn't mind killing her though. Yeah, but they're in. We're in serious right now with this this particular lot. So we need to do some curing of these guys. All right. So we need to make a run to Whitechapel and do some curing of them. Wait, which people in Whitechapel is it? Uh, okay, they're all right next to each other. If you kill someone in a social circle with someone, the other person will react to their death. Oh! Interesting. Where? Whoa. Run, 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 run. That was the button I meant. Ow. Excuse me. Woo! Just killed the whole circle. Wait a minute. This area wasn't skulls before. Interesting. That area was, uh, huh. Weird. Because some of them become hard as hell mini bosses? Oh. Oh, hey, it's you. Good evening, Zhao Shu. Wang Shanghao, Dr. Reed. It's good to see you again. Uh. What are you doing with your time now that you're back in Whitechapel? I've decided to help the poor and sick of the neighborhood by handing out medicine. Uh, that's very charitable of you. But why do it at night? I because notice that the most desperate people tend to go out <coughs> after dark. Why do it at night? Well, purpose. because then you would never Perhaps see me again and the game wouldn't uh, progress. Giving out medicine? How can you afford to do that? I am a rich widow, Dr. Reed. My departed husband left me enough money to last the rest of my life. I can spend some on those who don't have any. Hmm. Why don't you move to a better neighborhood? I thought about it, I confess. To go back to the same empty home every day. Still so, like, it, let's say I killed I someone uh, I who was in the same soul circle as someone else. And the other person would, like, try and attack me? useful in a familiar place than I would be anywhere else. 
Uh, personal question. Do you still think about your departed husband? Of course I do. I'll never forget Depends. my beloved okay. Matthew, but how do I put it? Now I miss him more than I want him back. I know what you mean. And I think it means you're getting better. Maybe death will take me the way it took Matthew. Without warning and without mercy. Are you wanting me to but kill until you? until then, I live on. How do you feel now that you're back in Whitechapel? I've decided to sure, follow you can give me your example, advice, vertical. sir. I won't forget the dead, but my efforts will be for the living. Um... Try not to lose yourself in the process. I've seen patients deny their own pain by focusing on the pain of others. To be completely honest with you, I'm also doing this for myself. If I'm destined to survive this epidemic, I need my life to have some purpose. Oh, okay. Uh... Nice, nice. Uh, so Vertical says, uh, if you kill Milton, Pippa, or for example, if you kill Milton, Pippa joins the guard and hunts you. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, interesting. So like, it would make sense to pick one person like that's a solo person and get rid of them. That would be your safest bets. And then um, otherwise, make sure that you're going to get rid of both of them. If you're the reverse, Mil Milton just chills. Oh, <laughs> he's like, oh, Pippa, uh, whatever. Huh, so if I was to go, oh, um, you don't almost want to kill like these three. That's a lot. That'd probably bring me down really far. I probably won't kill any of them to start. I I'll, I'll, I really want to do at least one at some point. Uh, But we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. Okay, we got some people to. Uh... How is the sanitary situation evolving in Whitechapel these days? The mother and son at the hospital. Yeah, they would be the two. That wouldn't be too bad. That approaches. I'm afraid we won't survive this trial, Doctor Reed. Goodbye. Okay. Is it this way? No, this way. Yeah, the son wants to go anyway, and then the mother would pretty much probably... I imagine the mother would actually probably kill herself if the son died. The way that their relationship is. Or something along those lines. Fancy pie. You never... Uh, Do you need... To be honest? I don't quite... Really? Okay, uh, let me see what you have for trade anyway. Oh, good trigger parts. Those are the things I need, I think. To upgrade my one weapon. Hold on, I'll have to look. Is there a way you can check? Yeah. Uh, good handle parts. I need three of them. Do you have three good handle parts? You never. Right then. Three. Oh, you have two. It's not even worth buying the two. Because I wouldn't be able to do it. Uh, well, that being said, can we upgrade the this? Three tiny good handle part. I, I don't think he's got it. Three tiny good handle part. Uh, yeah, no, he's only got two. So I'd have to find this other one somewhere else. You again. Can I offer keep you? There is a thin little run. Okay. Goodbye, Mr. P. He's now cured. And this douchebag up here. Good evening, Mr. It's far. Don't you fear faith? No doubt you're blessed. I have heard enough for tonight. Goodbye. Okay. Everyone should be now recovering or cured. They're all fine. They're all recovery. They're all recovery, and I don't know anyone in this pillar. Okay, cool. All right, that being said, let's find out where we need to go. What's this? Oh, that's the burial thing. I could try and fight Nurse Crane, but... 
I'll give it a shot since I'm here. But I'm not making any promises. Oh, I also could use some mice. Don't run, don't run. Ah, dang it. Oh. Well, that went really well. I don't have any blood. Nom, 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 nom. There we go. Oh, boy. Here's Nurse Crane. Looking all nice. Blood and figured I might as well do that right away. Okay, I gotta be careful. She is a way higher level than me. Just don't let her hit you. Sorry, Dorothy! Ow. She exploded. Well, I killed her that time. Now, I wonder if it's going to say she's, like, dead. Oh, it does! She's dead now! Yeah. I, yeah, I, I think I couldn't do a perfect game anyway. She's dead. And she's the pillar. I wonder if this one will never get that high anymore because she's dead. Oh, that makes a lot of sense, actually. Oh, boy. Treatment for headaches. Oh, glass vials. Treatments for cold. Treatments for fatigue. Medical voucher. Where's the medical voucher? Oh. Oh. She had a lot of good stuff. Beautiful flower. Oh, it's a beautiful flower just because I killed her. It's like an item to remind you, like, yeah, you killed her. Where is it? A small flower, like those offered by the poor, uh, to the poor by Do Dorothy's accomplice. Oh, okay. Not necessarily the, uh... Oh, hey. Hey, man. Well, Dorothy Crane's dead. We're just killing everyone now, apparently. I mean, I feel kind of bad, but at the same time, like, what else is I going to do? Uh, Swansea has some stuff. And then we can go on the Great Hunt. So let's head back to... Head back to the 
hospital. Should probably have goods to sell, but its effectiveness has been proven by many. Yeah, there's that dude too. It's gonna up. Just gotta make sure you get far enough away before they can do anything. Alright, we gotta talk to Swansea and then we can go. Yeah, so we got a decent amount of medicine from. Oh, all these ones. The. These ones. Hm. I'm okay with that. Hey, we'll take it. Dr. Swansea. There you are. It says you have stuff to talk to me about. Jonathan, old chap. How are you tonight? I've seen little of you of late. I was conducting research in my room. Away from the nightly routine. Of course, of course. Worry not, I understand. The situation has been testy around here. I won't deny it. But we still stand. Uh, what news? What news do you bring? The news is not good, my friend. We try to keep the epidemic at bay, but street violence is escalating quickly. Tell me more about the violence. Jeffrey McCallum seems to have sent his war dogs on a hunt. On a nightly basis, Prewen patrols exterminate every skull and vampire they find. Have they come closer to the hospital? No. They mainly focus on fallen districts or abandoned buildings. But they're growing in numbers. They must be recruiting heavily. How bad is the epidemic? It is killing the infected patients faster. In less than two days now. The only blessing is that they are contagious for a shorter period. Okay. I have received an alarming letter from Lady Ashbury. She wants me to meet her at her house. I have been granted safe passage. Then you are twice fortunate. I have never been invited to the lady's mansion. Oh. With the quarantine and controls, city access is nigh impossible. Is the quarantine serving any purpose? It is helping slow the propagation of the epidemic. But as long as we have no clue to its origin, its efficiency is limited. Why have you never entered the lady's house? You are one of her good friends, are you not? My dear Jonathan, you have no idea how reclusive the good lady normally is. Nor in what great esteem she must hold you to let you into her domain. Hmm. Have you any reliable friends in the West End who might assist me? Unfortunately, you will be alone. Except for our ravishing red-headed acquaintance, of course. Okay. What about the Brotherhood of St. Paul's Stoll? Where are they? There are only a few of us. Most others would not speak to you. I am the black sheep of our brotherly flock, you know. Oh, new hint. Edgar considers himself a maverick among the Brotherhood of St. Paul Stoli. Huh. Ooh, we're learning about you there, Dr. Swansea. Hope we don't get what to level six and kill you. Hospital. Nothing to fear, Jonathan. Your position here is in no jeopardy. You remain one of us. And you are always most welcome. All right. Thank you. Cool, cool. That got us some XP. We have a decent amount of XP. Um, I'm not going to rest now, though. Uh, however, I am kind of thinking... 
we might call it for today. Yeah. Been going for a little while. Kind of need at least a little break. Who knows if I'll play later or not. But I, I think I need a little bit of a break. Because we're doing that this game came from the same people who did Life is Strange. I haven't played Life is Strange. It was something I wanted to play. Just never got around to it. Like, I don't know. Just never got the opportunity to play it. So I was just like, hmm. Um, but yeah. How much longer would you say I've left in the game vertical? Like, how far off I, am I? I didn't think it was supposed to be that long of a game. But it's got, so far, a pretty decent amount of time in it. Any more medical supplies I can steal? I mean, take, borrow? Take and not give back? Yeah, there is. <laughs> there are more chapters. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs>